Hey guys, Mark and Grace here with Noble Notary. Today we are going to be talking about copy certifications. Also known as an A-tested photocopy, which can be done in Florida and some other states, not every state. Florida is definitely one of them. So we're going to show you um, if you're looking to get one done, how to get that done. Also, if you're a notary, how to properly execute one. Yep, well, let's do it. Okay, so first let's talk about what you can and can't do an A-tested photocopy or copy certification of. You cannot do a vital statistic or a vital record. You cannot make a copy of that as a notary, at least not in Florida. So those would be death certificates, birth certificates, marriage certificates, um, any official records that come from like a county clerk. You can't do those. What can you do and what are you most likely to see? You're going to see people need their ID copied. Um, usually they're sending in for a job application or maybe even it's going to another country and they're going to need it both notarized and in an apostille. So that is going to be a common thing. Passports are very common to have copies done. Uh, those are like 15, 20 pages for a passport. So, um, but they can all be, be attached to one a tested photocopy sheet. Uh, so those are common things. Some legal documents, uh, even notarized legal documents, you can attest to the copy of it. Um, so with that, let's talk about how we as an agency facilitate copy certifications with our mobile notary service. All right, so we are a staffing agency. So the way we go about this is we will staff a notary to meet with the client. Now the caveat is, is that the notary has to be able to make a copy. So if the client can make a copy, then the notary will travel there. Nine times out of 10, they're gonna meet at a public library, a Staples, someplace like that. Now, if you need this service and you would like to get a hold of us, it'll be our 800 number down below. Okay, so here you have the attested photocopy form. So as the notary, you're gonna be filling this form out. Of course, we have the venue, which is state and county, and then you're gonna be putting in, this is blank on them, so you're gonna be putting in the date, as we usually do, and then you attest that this is a true, exact, complete, and unaltered copy of, in this case, I put U.S. passport for an example, which is dated. Well, passport doesn't really have a date, but it may be a document with a date. It contains 21 pages presented to me by the custodian. So that would be whoever was asking you to do this, Tommy Tutone in this case. Um, and then to the best of my knowledge, it isn't a vital record or a certified copy. So in other words, it's not something that you're not supposed to copy. Sign, print, and then of course, put your seal there. And then you have completed an attested photocopy.